What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Plants vs. Zombies 3. Last episode we did the first five floors of the tower here. We're going to do the sixth floor. This is Devour Tower. Also, we're going to try to get our daily objectives complete uh, in order to bring us a step closer to fighting against Rainbow Glitz. I'm glad you guys have returned to the series. Thanks for all the likes and comments you left on the first episode. We are going to have a great time playing Plants vs. Zombies 3 today. We got a lot to unlock still, and this is going to take uh, place over the course of several episodes. If you look at the plants, we recently unlocked Blockbuster. If you take a look, lashes out with vines, prioritizes hitting obstacles, doing extra shatter damage to them, cinematic. Uh, we could go ahead and bring Blockbuster into our party here in order to fully showcase it. Um, I don't know what all's going to happen this episode, but I'm excited. Let's bring in um, Blockbuster. We'll replace uh, maybe Cabbage. Should we get rid of the cabbage? Let's, bring, let's get rid of the cabbage. Here, let's just uh, use, replace the cabbage. There we go. This is an interesting lineup of plants. Uh, power of 286 right now. It looks like we might be about to unlock the arena mode today. Uh, keep in mind, if you get uh, 300 gems, you can purchase the premium pass. Uh, I don't quite have that yet. And in fact, I don't think I have access to purchasing gems quite yet. So what's going on over here? I'm going to click this. Uh, this is Taco Truck. We were ready to upgrade this. Uh, we forgot to at the end of last episode. So let's go ahead and upgrade the Taco Truck to level 2, um, which will... Uh, okay, there we go. Did I do it? Yeah, now we get three tacos. So that's really cool. I don't have enough currency, or, nor do I have blueprints uh, to upgrade it to the next level. But right now, this is fantastic. Level 2 Taco Truck. There is a zombie here. We could fight the zombie. I want to go to Devour Tower because that's where it wants us to go. Um, overachiever, complete all of Brainiac tasks. Can't do that unless I do two arena battles, which I don't have yet. So let's go to the Devour Tower and take a look. It wants us to do floor six. It looks like it unlocks arena mode, right? That's what it looks like. Uh, indeed, it does. Now, you might know Arena from Plants vs. Zombies 2. Keep in mind, I'm still doing coverage of Plants vs. Zombies 2 alongside Plants vs. Zombies 3, so I'm super excited. This looks like two battles, two levels each battle, assuming uh, that, that works. And so let's start the floor and see what we got here. We have a ton of zombies. Now, we a lot of these zombies are brand new. Take a look at this guy. This is the actor zombie. When defeated, he does a Shakespearean death monologue for 10 seconds, blocking wasn't just for show it actually does block the shots so that's good to know and then if we want to take a look at um what else we got here we got uh let's take a look what is this guy this is cell phone zombie when her cell phone breaks she becomes enraged and speeds up screen timed this is a donut roller pushes a giant donut blocking plant attacks half baked and then uh this is the power walker walks quite fast and presumably with power toned very cool and then so we've and then this of course is a returning dog walker his dog attacks in, uh in his lane in adjacent lanes mangy so this is actually changed a lot from the dog walker of before or there no there wasn't a dog walker before <laughs> i got confused i was thinking newspaper zombie in my head anyway we'll see what happens uh the newspaper zombie is kind of like uh now the cell phone zombie because it seemed to have replaced the newspaper zombie to some degree let's fight we got some keys Let's uh, get this done today. Prepare for threats, we will. And so let's take a look at what we got going on here. We're back in the tower. That's what that's what's cool. We're back in the tower. Uh, ready. I kind of want to see what Blockbuster's all about. Uh, so, hey, I brought you some food that I ate it on the way. But I also brought you some plant food. So plant food is the next step in uh, letting me be powered up. Is that a power-up given to a plant to create an awesome special attack? Bango, it's like you've been using plant food for thousands of years. It's about time. You earn plant food over time during battles. If plants start to get eaten, you'll get even more. Here's an extra plant food. Give it to a plant and run for cover. Okay, so I can definitely do that. Uh, I don't know who I want to give it to yet. Let's put down the blockbuster, though. Okay, so that clearly has a range. That Oh, no, there we go. Okay, we're hitting it. Interesting. It doesn't seem quite... Okay, hold on. Let's give the plant food. I want to see what happens. Okay, that wasn't quite good enough. Okay, look, here, put this down here. Thankfully, we blocked it. Uh, here, put this down. This is, I know, we're, we've saved, saved up a lot of sun, though, and now we can blast away. So go ahead and blast away, please. Thank you. Oh, man, we need to get one more off. Please do it again. One more time, 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 please. Boom. There you go. Okay, so this, this blockbuster is a really interesting thing, but of course, the blockbuster focuses on obstacles, and we don't really have that quite yet. So... 
I'm gonna go ahead and get uh, the bamboo shoots. I love that name, by the way. Huge wave of zombies is approaching. And uh, there, there it is, right there. We need to maybe block this guy. That guy's gonna come through. I assume it's gonna be pretty dire when he makes it. Now I could give plant food to whoever I want. I think we're gonna wait till stage two though before doing that. I don't mind doing a times two multiplier to speed things up a little bit, get more stuff showcased within. We can give three people, let's give them here. There you go. And also, I kind of want to move this up a little bit, move this up a little bit. I like that you get to move these things. Let's put this uh, right in the middle. We're ready to go. So that dog walker, a uh, boom. Okay, hold on, I want to get a seventh, uh, I mean a fifth one, cost seven. We got symmetry on the bamboo shoots. Oh, so here's the thing. This needs to attack, attack the obstacles. Now, the, the positioning of this is a little odd, but it blew up the obstacle really, really quickly, really nicely. Let's give this to the, uh, boom, we buttered multiple zombies. Very cool. Right there, right there. All right, huge wave of zombies approaching. Don't, don't worry, don't worry about it. We got this. He's running, he's running. Look at him, look at him go. We got him. Break that donut if you can. Nice. We completed it. So now we're going to move on to the second. So the terminology is a little weird. We got like another battle coming up. That was the first stage. This is the second stage. And each stage has two. No, sorry. Each battle has two stages. So there's two battles, two stages for, per battle. So that's how it works out to complete floor six in particular. So let's go ahead and participate. I'm going to bring down. I, I want the I want the corn out. I really do. I like the idea of slowing her down a little bit, and thus, uh, okay, the middle one's going a little fast. Okay, the middle one's, okay. If we don't butter them, then they're gonna, they're gonna go ahead and, and ruin me, so. Okay, I'm gonna put that down, the pine needler. I'm gonna put down some corn there. Now, see the top row, that's an issue. The top row is not getting buttered up, so I assume that when I upgrade the corn, oh, there's a butter for the, oh, no, oh, no. I just realized now, oh, he moved. That imp is moving back and forth. That's a hot dog imp. Okay, interesting. This is a little bit more challenging than I was expecting. So the hot dog imp is there. Now, if that hot dog imp moves again, I'm going to be worried. Nice, hot dog imp frozen in place again. Let's butter up several people, several zombies. That was good. Okay. No, oh, man, I, didn't, I wasn't able to plant it in time. I like the art style. Some people didn't like the the, the, the two, uh, or, sorry, the, the move from 2D to 3D, but I kind of like the art style. I think it looks pretty good. I think they did a great job with this game so far. Uh, just moving these around, trying to figure out how best to move these. I'm actually going to move these back here and then put the pea shooters in the front. This looks good enough to me. Uh, and I gave the tacos away to the corn. So there we go. And we have plant food. Don't forget we have plant food. There's the actor zombie. I, I, I should try to come up with a better name for the actor zombie. I think it could use a better name. I don't know what it would be yet, but let's see. Uh... All right, there he goes. Maybe you guys can come up with a good name for the actor zombie in the comments below. So, uh, oh boy, this guy is for real. Well, let's put more of these down. Blockbuster there. And I get it now why it's called Blockbuster, because it busts blocks. Particularly the, the donut in this case, so that's why. Now, here we go with the, uh, with the pigeons. This is a park trick, pigeon plunge. Now we do have corn. Let's go ahead, I have plant food. I should have used it on the, on the boosted corn or the one that had the taco. So stage two clear, so we've finished both, uh, both battles. Uh, the terminology's throwing me off, but we finished both battles. We got a gold pinata. We got the buttercup. Block zombies, butter zombies that attack her, stunning them, fattening, bamboo shoots. Eventually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do individual plant showcases, just like I do for PVZ2. But the only thing I'm waiting for is for me to kind of get deeper into the game because they're throwing so many plants at us right now, it's impossible to just, like showcase each one. But we got Starfruit and Arena unlocked, so complete with other players in the arena. Have you ever wondered if you're the best? I know I'm the best, but 
Yes, Wonder. I know. <laughs> That's me right there, Bong Choi. You can prove your skills in the arena, competing to climb the arena leagues for high scores and rewards. I got nothing to prove. Nonetheless, I am angrily intrigued by this development. So let's check out the arena, then, which just unlocked. Player name, and then I, I hope that I can grab my name really quick. Zach Scott. Whoop, that's with the P. Confirm. There we go. And who do I want as my avatar? Uh, Mushroom seems pretty cool to me. And so...